Hey, so oh ho. Hello, what's up, man? I'm Richard Tower of Gods. Wow! Oh my God, guys, it is time for the most hyped-up non-sequel anime of the season to be aired. And yes, it's on April the first, so it's April Fool's Day. But you know, at least Crunchyroll is not fooling us around with the release of Dark Tower of Gods because I am really looking forward to checking out Tower of Gods because apparently I've been. You know, been going around reading comments on many of the PVs and stuff like that, and of course I reacted to the PV not long ago too. So hope you, thank you guys so much for the amazing comments below. And but by the way, yes, the PVs. Oh my god, just reading the comment section below. Oh my god, you guys have been hyping up for this show, and not just on my PV reaction, also in many of the PV videos where I read the comment section below. And everyone is so hyped up for this show. And of course, you know, many people actually read the webtoon novel online too. So let's just say I am really excited to check out this show because many people are saying that this. This could be contender of the anime of the year. I mean, basically, you can say that to any shows nowadays. But this is say people say that this show have potential, man. I mean, I mean, it's, it's been licensed by Crunchyroll. It's a Crunchyroll original, so if Crunchyroll is go really, is really going all in to you know invest in this show, maybe they they make they say this is going to be a very good show indeed. So yeah, my God, I mean, this is say this show is actually a very unique show because like apparently it's not going to be adapted from any typical anime or manga. Uh, with like novel and stuff like that uh, it's basically being adapted on a korean webtoon guys a korean webtoon it was just like the very first time from my experience watching anime that something is being adapted from a korean manhwa so yeah to, to be honest i don't know much about this and uh, about this manhwa because i didn't like really go about to read the the online webtoon because like I, i'm not really much of a um, you know, reading stuff outside of Jap um, Japanese manga and stuff like that. But let's just say people say that this is actually going to be a very interesting show indeed. I mean, for those who read the, the webtoon online, of course. So yeah, let's just say this is a very Korean adaptation. I'm not really surprised with that because like apparently I've been told that this is like the one piece of Kore of the Korean ma web manhwa, webtoon, whatever you call it. So you can say it's gonna mean a lot for any like those korean fans out there and of course for anyone who reads the online webtoon and apparently it's not gonna be adapted by mappa i made a mistake it's apparently being adapted by um telecom animation film which i never really heard of them before but let's just say um if country will be licensed but if country are really gonna go out, out to promote the show then they can say that this is gonna be a very interesting show indeed or should say uh, one of those hyped up show for this season i mean people hyping it up though the thing i don't like uh, the fact that people keep on hyping up is that you, when you start watching it you start to say oh man i thought it would be better that's a, a, the reaction but who knows who knows and well let's just say when i go through my comment section just to like to be for the reaction people have been telling me that is the story is gonna be absolutely amazing if the adaptation is done right there is gonna be contender of the anime of the year character design is amazing stories even better plot twists and stuff like that gonna happen in the story and of course like people say that um, the story is mostly the reason why people really enjoy the show and of course um, the protagonist it's gonna be well a very interesting fella for me to enjoy and it's gonna be uh, one epic webtoon adaptation uh horror shit and stuff like that and very difficult um very different from sao by the way i try i, I thought it compared to sao in terms of like going to different level of floors and stuff like that but guess people told me it's not like danmachi or sao sort of like go battling different floors it's just like a bigger world building than just like fighting bosses and go to different levels so i've been told by that yeah apparently uh, many koreans will be very excited for the show i've got i've got a couple of Korean subscribers so hopefully I get to see you guys in the conversation below of course but for now I want to uh, give episode 1 a very blind reaction to see how good the show is and well hopefully it doesn't disappoint with the how they start the show I mean hopefully and you guys can help me out in the conversation below in terms of how well they adapted to the webtoon I'm not planning to read the webtoon anyways we're going to stay blinded for the, throughout the season and if, if the season ends in a very cliffhanger way I may go go about to read it but who knows we shall see because I've been told there'll be a lot of plot twists so without further ado, let's get started the reaction, shall we? So let me just get started. Okay, we're ready, and let's get started the reaction, shall we? Okay, let's check out what's so hyped up about Tower of God. Since I, you know, come into this as an anime only, let's just see how much surprise I've been told that I'll be having for the show. And so yeah, from without further ado, it's been a month since I reacted to the PV. Let's do this, shall we? So here we go in three, two, one, bam! Crunchyroll Originals Of course, of course, and Webtoon Production Let's do this man, let's do this 
Oh yo, check out the animation. Now that is some new way of animating a series. Oh monster. Honor and pride. Oh ho ho ho. Hey yo, check out this new style of animation. I've never seen this style before. It looks like one of those typical Chinese animation style though, if I remember correctly, but yeah. Money and riches. Hmm. <laughs> oh ho, ho. Hey, hey. Yo, check out the reflection on the war, man. <laughs> oh damn. Holy cow, check out that monster, yo! Now that is some nice looking monster right there. Oh, holy cow. Dude, are they like already at the tower or something? Oh, great background music, man. Great background music. Mm hmm. You can become a god. I mean, it's called kind of Tower of God, so pretty much like reaching the top of you become a god, I guess. <laughs> mm-hmm. And the and and the beginning. Ha ha ha! Oh, the opening, man! It's by a Korean band, by the way. It's done by a Korean band. <laughs> oh, damn it! Hey, hey, jam it down, man. Tower of God, let's do this! Oh ho. Oh damn, now let's jam to this, man. Oh ho ho, yo, the opening, man. <laughs> oh ho, yo! Now that is some nice opening. I oh, love the visual, man. It's not every day you hear like a Korean band do like an opening for an anime series. Wait. Wait, it's in Japanese though. Wait, is it in Japanese version? Wait, it's in Japanese version. Oh shit, it's in Japanese version. Is that, is that like a Korean version by the way? If you have so, can comment below of course. I'll just hear the Korean version. I think that was the Japanese version. But the opening is a, is a banger man, the opening is a banger. Um, so they're already at the tower. Okay, so they'll go straight with the action. Interesting. Hmm. What happened here? Oh, hey, yo, wow, okay. Wow, okay, interesting, oh, interesting start to this episode. Yo, wow, what happened here? Why are they, are they running away from a monster? Or are they just basically just flirting around? Forgetting about me. Oh ho, whoa, what do we have here? Hey, hey, whoa, okay. Okay, a sad scene already. Um right so what happened so they entered the tower it's rachel hmm. so, wait she died already or she just entered the uh, tower um okay interesting we go straight with this scene which i have no idea what the hell just happened Oh, 
Um, did she die? <laughs> oh, sad times. And now it's his turn to enter the tower. Oh, check out the hand, man. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> White uh, steel eel and ball. What? What kind of strange title for this episode? Okay, so without any like sort of preparation, they just entered the tower already. Okay. Guess episode one needs to have a like a banging star, I guess. Oh hey, yo, check out is that is that a rabbit? Holy cow. So that's the one is that like the one in charge here? Oh, this is it. <laughs> hmm. Of course, man. Of course, he knows you because you entered the tower. <laughs> hey. Oh yeah, climb the tower. Lo no, find the answers. Mm-hmm. Test though. There's an entrance test? Wait, there's an entrance test to entering a tower? Ho 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 yo, check out that monster. So he has to fight that thing, I guess. You enter the cage and Oh, okay. Break that ball. So, th so this is like his trial before he enter the tower. Okay, so I mean, it seems easy enough to go in and break the ball with, and, and bypassing the eel. <laughs> oh, ho ho! Guess it'll be another obstacle. Ho oh, ho yo, check out this chick. What? What is that Korean? What was, what language was that? Uh what language was that? Was that Korean? Oh, oh. oh hey, there we go. Uh-huh. Interesting. Invisible mode. Oh ho hey. <laughs> non regular. <laughs> mm-hmm. So when you say non regular I think he's like your first timer, I guess? Princess of Jahad. Damn, so she's a princess? She's a princess, okay. <laughs> wow, well, how to say that? That uh, headband is really uh, standing out. And that can, uh, can, can explain her beauty too. Wow, well, okay, so, okay, so it's gonna be a tough test for him, since tw level 20 can't even handle it. Oh, damn, <laughs> criticism right there. Oh, hey, yo, oh, ho, ho, handsome. Oh, okay, he's just a caretaker. Okay. Mm hmm. Hey, hey. Mm hmm. 
You, you want to climb it just to save ratio, I guess. <laughs> mhm. Mm hey, so is she helping out? I guess. Oh, yo, check out that sword. Damn, look at the height difference too. Oh wait, okay. Wow, okay. <laughs> You, you, it's just because he's handsome, okay? Wow, I didn't say I'm liking this princess Yuri. Get it, Yuri? Yeah, he's climbing the tower to save Rachel. From the looks of it. Let's do this, his first action. That's a, by the way, that's a weird looking sword. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Lady Yuri. <laughs> oh yeah. Dude, if that's like the case then that was fast. Mm-hmm. Okay, so she just Helping out because she, she maybe sees something in him or maybe she's just helping out a handsome dude. I just say he's kinda of good looking by the way. Oh, by the way, that monster looks really hard to defeat. <laughs> it's almost like your final boss fight. Oh hey, here we go. He's just standing there. Come on, just chop it! Hey! Oh my god, did he just let that thing just eat him? Oh, is he trying to kill it from the inside? Oh, okay! Wow, that's the worst way to die. Huh, what? So, he's killing from the inside? Yep, knew it. He's killing from the inside. Hey, there we go. He's killing from the inside. Ah ha ha! Wait, what? He just... Oh! Okay. So, over... Overcoming death, huh? Yeah. Seems like he's going to do something ridiculous. Uh, hey, so he passed the test. Uh, hey, oh, what? Is what? You haven't begun, like what? Oh my god. Yeah, what are you planning? So there's more to this game, I guess? Or this trial? Yeah, he's making no progress at all. Wait, there's like more to the, t the test, I guess. Okay, we're going to have some flashback to before the, the tower. Like how... Oh, okay, this is like a flashback motivation to get him like breaking the ball. Ah, uh, is that Rachel? Hey, that's a Rachel. Seems like he's like one of those people who got trapped in a hole and then he's like they don't know what his life is. Hey, yo, check out Rachel, man.
I just say Rachel is kind of like well, nice looking characters. Hmm. <laughs> Mm-hmm. All right, okay. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, with sheer determination, he gonna, he can break it. Ah, round two. Round two. Oh, hey, okay. Speak to the... So the sword can respond to a chant. Hey, so oh ho ho, yo ho, no way. Why why can't why some why some else are coming to be honest? But oh, now that is what I call a great visual effect. Guess that's a sword. What? I don't care what it's how. I just want to say ratio. Near, near it. Such a boring boy. <laughs> I mean, a boring boy yet a determined boy. Wow! Again with cute face. <laughs> he... Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much, I guess. <laughs> wow, okay, so pretty boy wins. So I guess being a pretty boy can be advantages. I'll give you advantage over so many things. It broke. Oh, so he passed the trial. Uh, hey, well, it's his now. Yeah, the source. I think the source is his now since the the source is so is up to him. <laughs> mhm. Mm Yo, I just destroyed it. <laughs> oh, of course you are excited to see what's next. So this is like one of the, the sort of tests we get first see first time what sort of trial each floor will have. Right, okay, so test two, the regulars. So round two, oh, so it's the next floor. So different floors have different trials to pass. Oh, this should be interesting, I guess. This should be very interesting. Because I do love a good like f floor passing boss battle and pass to the next floor and stuff like that. Okay, so what's the test on the floor? Mm-hmm. 
What? Are you telling me to kill? Oh my god, so this is like some sort of death game happening now. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. So it's basically going to be a death game on the second test. Holy cow, okay. So he has to go and eliminate people now. And dude, better watch out, man. People will be coming after your life. And there's your sword. <laughs> and he's first opponent. Oh god. Yeah, he's a non regular, so he don't know. Oh! Oh ho! Someone saved him. Oh! Oh ho! Oh ho! Oh god, there goes the first person. No, she's coming after your life now. No, he coming after your life. Oh! Oh, wait! Oh, Charles Knight! One, one person died after another. Oh! Oh my god! One person died after the other. Damn, people are killing each other quite quickly. Ha <laughs> ha! Nah. Nah, uh, well, it's, it's very simple yet very deadly. Hey, yo. You have to, like, eliminate. You're, you're fucked. You're, you're fucked. Oh wow, okay. So he's like the nicer one. Oh, okay, so that lizard is a trouble one. Oh, so he can sense weapons. Oh shit, he's after him. So he's after a strong opponents, and he doesn't look strong, but it's the sword that is actually strong. Yeah, him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Uh oh, here we go. Oh god, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be so good. Oh, you have to wait for the episode 2. Oh god. Nice cliffhanger right there. A really good cliffhanger right there. So I guess this is the ending theme. Okay, I am loving this show, guys. I am loving this show so far. G love the the very different t take to the animation style. So Telecom Studio, you guys did a uh, fantastic job with the animation of the uh, this Tower of God, because I'm loving the character design. Oh, ho, ho, the ending theme, man. Oh man, the, the, the ending man. It's a Japanese version, so I want to hear the Korean version. Oh man, loving the theme. The back, the ending theme is even amazing. Oh my god, Tower of God, 
I can see why people could be enjoying this show a lot. For and for any like non webtoon readers, I can see that people are gonna really enjoy the show in terms of the animation of the show. I I just say I'm loving the animation of the show a lot and the character design, especially for the female design. I say I say I I think you just found my favorite girl of the series already, dude. Princess Yuri, I think that's her name. Princess Yuri. Oh my god, loving her design. Loving it, man. Black hair. Uh, by the way, guys, anime girls with black hair or blonde hair or sometimes pink, pink hair, my instantly my favorite girl already. If they have like brown, dark brown hair, black hair, pink hair, blonde hair, instantly my favorite character already. Cause look at this, man. Oh, whole cat. She's a chick, and she supported him because he's good looking. Wow. Okay. So just because he's good looking, so she becomes so nice to him. Interesting, um, but yeah, it seems like we can go straight with the the tower game, I guess. Or put it this way, the tower trial or whatever you call it. And from the looks of it, that we I think we're gonna skip the backstory for. I think I, for for some reason I thought that episode one gonna start off with the backstory, like uh, learning how um, where he came from, how he met Rachel and stuff like that, and why how did Rachel die or should she fade away or enter the tower or whatever, whatever, whatever happens to her. So yeah, it seems like we already get the like, uh, main plot of the story, going through the tower, going to the top of the tower. Simple enough, I guess, going to the top of the tower to become a god or grant you your wish or what whatsoever. So yeah, it seems like we, I think we're gonna skip the backstory. I mean, I mean, I mean, we can tell that he was stuck in the, some sort of cave and Rachel rescued him, so that's why he cherished Rachel. But I mean, I want if I were, I really want to find out his backstory though. Like what, uh, what really got him to uh, into this situation before rescue Re Rachel rescue him? How those two sort of developed a bond before the tower? What's his motivation to falling? Uh, what's his Rachel motivation or his motivation to enter the tower and stuff like that? But I mean, he kind of mentioned that he wanted to like, go rescue Rachel or meet up with Rachel again. But yeah, what what kind of led them to enter the tower? I want to see. I want to find out about that. But guess we just have to uh, like wait until the next future episodes for that. Uh, but at least we know the first episode. The thing I like about it is mostly the animation. Uh, I mean, I love the quality of the this sort of unique change in the animation style. And by the way, this anim I'm really loving the st the style of the character design. Kind of reminds me of some. I don't know. Kind of reminds me of some of the cartoons I used to watch back in my childhood days, like the Chinese cartoons or some some shows from Cartoon Network. But I have to say, I'm loving this character. There's nothing wrong with this, the animation. I'm loving the animation style. It's, at least it's different from from any of the show this season. Um, but yeah, it seems like we get to see the first trial. Should I say the entrance exam? Yeah, it seems like uh, every floor will have different like sort of trial, like uh, some simple, uh, simple like um gold. So basically, in this one, you had to break the ball, but there's like hidden rich, hidden like um mess. Uh, well, like side mission along the way around around the each floor. Like one for him, he needs to overcome death, and two, he needs to somehow um accept being stronger or something like that. But yeah, it seems like he managed to acquire the black sword because of, again, he's cute. And the girls the sort of accept like cute guys, so yeah, why not? I guess. Um, but yeah, I just say not bad, not very, not bad stuff. We get at least we get the pl the whole plot of the story, going to a diff different floor, going through different like um missions. In this case, the second floor, the floor, the test two is basically the the last two hundred to survive wins. And seems like we get, uh, go go out with a good start. Like and we, many people die, and then we get to see firsthand how strong individual uh, fighters are, especially this guy. I mean, he literally just butchered him, so you can tell that he's gonna be uh, one of those badass um, supporting characters, or maybe main characters. But who knows? We I mean, wait, is there like any like um, team formation or some sort of, like people work together, or this is like more of a um, solo thing because like I, I guess I feel like this is kind of this can be either be a solo thing or can be like forming a team thing and work together to go with different floor and they'll be they're all backstabbing and stuff like that so yeah it seems like he managed to acquire himself a sword but he's, he's a non-regular so he's basically a weakling but I'm pretty sure throughout the floor he started to learn more how to fight and learn more how to use the sword probably so he can become you know a very suitable fighter to survive in on each floor and 
I feel like on each floor there'll be like more uh, like different like side trials to like test him and get making sure that he able to grow as a person. That's why I feel like this story gonna go into. But for now, I can tell that there's gonna be a lot of like death action games, like a lot of like interesting monsters appearing. And I just say, loving the graphics design, really loving the graphics. And the opening though, yeah, it's a Japanese version, but I want to hear the Korean version. So if you guys have the Korean version, do comment below and do, like check out the Korean version. I will share to react to it. Um, but other than that, yeah, I'm loving what I saw in God, um, Tower of God so far. Um, Rachel, for some reason, she just vanished without getting getting to know her more. I mean, she, she's a very kind person from what I can see. Um, yeah, I'm loving it, loving the character design, especially the the. Princess Yuri, oh man, loving her. I think she's my favorite girl already. Uh, yeah, seems like next episode we're gonna see more of this um, test two trial and see how they, how he's gonna survive in this floor. But yeah, I'm really looking, for, looking forward to it because a lot of people already die already. But I want to see more of him in, like in action scene, whether or not he can like so like able to improve as a fighter because that that'll be something i would love to see improving improving as a person to in order to survive on each floor and of course see whether or not he can go rescue rachel but for now we shall see whether that will be the case for in the future episodes but for now episode one is a very good start i'm loving what i saw so far and i'm hopefully next episode gonna be even better so hope you guys enjoy our today get a like and interest and subscribe to the channel something